Need some roadside assistance? It's time for the Pike Breakdown Lane on 100 FM, The Pike. We do it every Friday. We uh, lovingly collect your messages and play them back at this time, 830. And uh, you can leave them 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And on this Veterans Day, uh, hopefully we got some tributes in with these uh, messages for your Pike Breakdown Lane. Let's see what kind of trouble we can get into this week. Hello, and welcome to the Adult Toy Hall of Fame. (laughs) In the words of the Beatles, got to get you into my life and the Bee Gees. <laughs> How deep is your love? Oh, very good. I announced this year's inductees, plug in oh. edible panties. Thank you. This was the Adult Toy Hall of Fame induction ceremony. Go home, perverts. <laughs> Well, uh, Adam uh, has uh, the headline this morning that they inducted three. It was the top and uh, Masters of the Universe. And Light Bright. He-Man or what? Or Light Bright, right? Yeah. And uh, the guy was just so, I don't know, he, it was just such a lame announcement for the Toy Hall of Fame. You think it would be a lot more fun? Uh, and he made some kind of weird Cole Porter joke. As songwriter Cole Porter might say, it's the top. So that's that's guys making musical references there. That was very good. Thank you. Hey, Shu. I just wanted to give a shout out to our mutual friend and Chuck D's buddy, Lucas Carr, who's an Army Ranger, Boston firefighter, marathon runner for the Matt Brown Foundation. And he was there when the marathon bombs went off at the finish line. And because of the kind of person he is, he jumped right into action to start saving lives right after running 26 miles. And knowing that we have people like Lucas Carr on our team in our armed services reminds me of why this country is so great. And it also reminds me that I'm a complete wimp. (laughs) Yeah, I think I I mentioned Lucas earlier. He's the guy that has the huge American flag. He runs in his uh, in his uh, like fatigues and his army boots. Yeah. And um, his story is interesting because when he was. Still in high school. He left high school because he started a very, very successful landscaping business. And so he was just like, well, I'm already working. I don't need to finish school. And then um, the attacks on 9-11 happened. And he gave all, he had a very successful business. He gave all that up and joined the Army and became a Ranger. Wow. And did a few tours in Iraq. And uh, he's been very supportive of veterans and and uh, and uh, a lot of people. He's he's a really great guy. Like really that caller great. said, when disaster strikes, he's the guy who yeah. runs towards it, not away from it. Absolutely, he's that kind of guy. And we we thank him. We thank all the veterans today. Hey, I'd like to say a happy Veterans Day to my brother Stephen Reinhardt of Natick, Mass. All I'm right. proud of him. He did a great job. All right, all you veterans out there, have a great day. Love you. Nice, nice. Yeah, this is uh, Joe. I'm a vet, Air Force or National Guard. I'm just calling to wish all the other vets a happy Veterans Day. And also just to spread some information, because there are some places that are offering local eateries, stuff that are offering mm. you know, free breakfast sandwiches and other things. So McDonald's and Wendy's are both offering free breakfast sandwiches to so anybody who wants to come in and get them veterans on the Sherry VA card. Price Shopper is offering free coffee and a free oh, donut. Nice. Slash Market 32. Chick Fil A is offering uh, free lunches for for the veterans. Applebee's the same thing. It's a limited menu, but they're offering that. Tim Texas Roadhouse and Olive Garden are both offering free dinners or discounts on certain dinners for veterans as long as you show your VA card. And all thank you for your service and have a good day. Yeah, a lot of deals out there. We post. There's even more, and we posted them on our Facebook page. If you're a veteran, you could take advantage of them. Today. Yeah, Chili's, IHOP, Denny's as mm-hmm. well. Uh, yeah, and they're all online. Yep, free hot dog from Seven Eleven. Show your VA card or your proof that you're a veteran, and and they'll hook you up. My name is Kelly, and I am just calling on this beautiful Veterans Day to thank all military, both active and retired, for services. My son is still in the military. He joined in July, and he is in the process of of finishing up his training, and he will be shipping out to South Korea in December. And I want to thank him for his service and wish him the best and to stay safe. Thank you. Have a great weekend, everybody. Nice. Well, Mm. we we feel the same way. Thank you. Thank you for your service. Well, hello, Mike Shue. This is uh, a veteran. I would like to say happy birthday to all of the Marines out there. Sympathize. And to the rest of the veterans, thank you very much, and you will have a great day. Yeah, awesome. Well, thank you very much. That's great. Thanks for all the shout-out, the Veterans Day shout-outs on the 
the breakdown lane today. And uh, I, I want to mention someone who texted in, uh, this guy Jeff Mackey, because I put it out there on, on our Twitter feed that, you know, we're, we're looking for shout-outs for veterans. And yeah. he tweeted back, he wants to give a shout-out to his dad, Steve Mackey, United States Marine Corps, um, his uncle, Dennis Mackey, United States Air Force, his grandfather, Olavi Mackey, U.S. Army Air Corps in World War II, Don Fenwick, his uncle, U.S. Navy, Walter Hekakila, I think that's how you say that, his grandfather, also in the U.S. Army, Auntie Mackey in the U.S. Army, who is his uncle, his cousin, Don Fenwick, who's in the Navy, and his great-uncle, Tuano Matson. U.S. Army, World War II. Wow, what a family of service. Right. What an amazing line of service there. So thanks for letting us know about that. And please, if please, thank you. Thank your family for their service. That's, that's pretty amazing. And thank you for your calls on the breakdown lane. We do it every Friday. Don't worry. We'll never call you back. And uh, we won't sell your information because we just don't know how. You can call the Pike Breakdown Lane 24 hours a day at 774-670-0231. We are here for you. Well, not really. Just leave a voicemail message.